This is Lisa from Mobile Tech Review and today we're going to take a look at multi-touch web browsing on Android 2.0 devices. That means the Motorola Droid that we're using right now, the Nexus One, and any other 2.0 device that's coming out. This happens courtesy of the Dolphin Web Browser. This is new version 2.0 that just came out a couple of days ago. This supports pinch and zoom web browsing and it renders pages just as well and as quickly as the default Android browser which is which is no small feat because it's a pretty darn good browser. This is free to download from the Android Marketplace and you'll occasionally see little ads. This is the home page for the Dolphin web browser here and we've got a Google ad down here but you'll see teeny little ads occasionally at the bottom. You don't actually have to do anything to enter a URL. You don't have to bring up the control for the URL bar. You start typing and you can finish it. In this case, we'll pick our own home page. We'll close it since we don't need the keyboard. So here it's rendered our page perfectly well. Scroll around quickly. But here's the cool thing. Pinch, pinch, zoom. So those of you who are coming from an iPhone and can't stand the lack of multi-touch, are going to love this browser. It also supports gestures with version 2.0. Instead of just writing the gesture on the screen where it might be confusing as to whether you're actually typing something on the page, tapping something on the page, or making a gesture. So say you want to search on the page, you just do that symbol, and it brings up the Find window. Likewise, you can hit make an M to bring up bookmarks and more. And you can add your own gestures as well. It's got a bunch of other features. It automatically detects RSS feeds on web pages. So you can see here there's a subscribe to RSS feature. You can share page and send it to Delicious, Facebook, or Twitter. You can uh, pick up Google bookmarks. Supports downloads. And you can save your temporary files to the SD card. You can also do things like select text. And it copies it to the clipboard automatically. So if you're looking for a very capable multi-touch browser for your Android Nexus One or Motorola Droid, Dolphin is highly recommended and it's free. You can also set the Dolphin web browser to be your default web browser, making it ever so much more convenient to use. I'm Lisa from Mobile Tech Review. Visit our website to read the full write-up of Dolphin 2.0 for Android.